Good afternoon, guys. Yeah, I'm sorry, it's me again, but welcome to another review from me, Matt, the Bitty Berserker. Very interesting to see what the subtitles comes up with for that, because apparently, so I've been told by quite a few about you out there, that as soon as I go, the Bitty Berserker, that YouTube cannot work out what the hell I'm saying, and it comes up as all sorts of different things, which I've had the pleasure of watching my videos and seeing some of the monstrosities that it's coming out with. But I hope you guys are well, enjoying your weekend, wherever you are in the world, whatever you've been getting up to. Huge, huge, massive support. Uh, thanks for all the support that I'm getting here on my Beard of Berserker YouTube channel and over there on Instagram as Viking Beard Map, where I'm literally working my socks off and trying my hardest to help promote, support and advertise only small brands, individuals and craftsmen that are making some really, really amazing products. So you'll notice with all my videos, been asked a couple of times that it's like, well, all your videos, they just seem to be one long thing. There's no cuts or anything like that. It's because I'm literally working with my iPad. I'm old. I have some form of newish technology. I'm only an Apple iPad Air 2 or whatever they're called in front of me. No real way of editing my videos and stuff like that. So you'll notice with all the videos and reviews that I do, have my notes written in front of me. All my videos are literally one long thing from start to finish, no cuts, no editing or anything like that, no flashy graphics popping up because I can't do it. I don't know what I'm doing and I'm trying my hardest with what I've got. But thank you guys for, like I say, all support. It's literally amazing and I cannot thank you enough. Now this afternoon's review has been very, very, very kindly sent through from We Are Scumbags or Scumbag Clothing UK. Links will be down below in the description box. Please be sure to give them some help, support and a follow. And I've done a couple of reviews in the past for Scumbag Clothing UK. Very, very kindly, he has sent me through a t-shirt to have a look at, see what I think of, give you guys my honest opinion. And with all the reviews I do on my channel, all of my reviews are completely honest, completely unbiased, and everything I do is my own opinion, okay? Um, so I'm not here to blow smoke rings up at people's backsides. If there's reasons why I like a product, I'll say why I like it. Equally, if there's a reason why I don't like a product, say constructively why I don't like a product. So, Scumbag Clothing is based here in the UK, um, an alternative brand of clothing, unisex, it's t-shirts and hoodies, and he has got so many designs out. Um, literally any design that he puts up on uh, Instagram, he's quite happy to put onto t-shirts and sweatshirts and stuff like that. He's very kindly, we've been chatting to each other, very kindly printed the design for me, put his kind of twist on it, sent it through to me to see what I think of and give you guys my honest opinion. So with t-shirts and stuff like that, in order, order to simulate a bit of wear and tear on them, rather than sort of wearing them for five years and then trying to do the review on it, I put them through three one hour long washes, not at the same time because that's just stupid. Pidity, um, with other clothes obviously, so I'll wash it, dry it, wash it, dry it, wash it, dry it, wear it for a bit so I can check the quality on it, whether the design's peeling off, the stitching's come undone and stuff like that. Now you will notice as well, I'm wearing another one of the reviews I'd done quite a while back actually for Scumbag UK and this is to show, this has been worn loads of times this t-shirt has. It's been washed more times than I probably washed myself. Um, and there has been absolutely no issues at all with any of the graphics peeling off or anything whatsoever. It's not stretched, it's not shrunk, no bobbling, no issues with the seams and stuff. But the design that he has created for me on this t-shirt is absolutely stone. T-shirts that it's printed on is Gildan Soft Style Ring Spun. 100% um, cotton t-shirts, sort of taped seams around the top and down the shoulder panels. Um, I'm not sure if this one's a tubular one. I don't know. 
So much tubular. Um, this one that I'm actually wearing is the seams that run down the side. As you can see, seams that run down the side. This one that I'm about to show you doesn't have, so this is like a tubular fit t-shirt. I don't know if that's a thing, a tubular design uh, side. But this is the design he has done for me and it is absolutely epic. I hope, sorry about the dog hairs on that, but I have two dogs. One's having a bath at the moment and the other one you can see is over there by the door waiting for Roxy to come through because she's, she's having a weekly bath. But the design itself is absolutely stunning. You've got Scumbag UK logo on the bottom there. This was the design that I actually sent through to him, bless him, which he has crop Look, dog ears everywhere. The joys of black in the house when you've got dogs. But this has been through three hour long washers. The prints on these are soft. Then I remember back in the past, um, down the road, we had a place that used to print t-shirts and you pick your design, pick your t-shirt, they put it on there for you. And the designs kind of like the early designs that they used to put on t-shirts were so thick that literally the front of it would stand out straight. There was no give in it. Whereas these are a lot, lot softer. Um, there has been no issues at all with any of the design peeling, even if I show you the hair and everything on there, there is no peeling, pop, uh, picking or anything like that happening on it at all, So, which is really great to see, because there is nothing worse. I've had that before where I've been out, I've spent a lot of money in shops on, on t-shirts, sort of like 25, 30, 35 pound, sometimes a bit more actually, if I like the design on it. And you, you buy it because of the design. You tend not, I personally tend not to buy stuff because of the actual t-shirt, unless it's fair trade, um, sustainably sourced and stuff like that. But you tend to buy t-shirts because you go, really love that design on there. And there is nothing worse than getting it home within a month or so, the design's peeling off or anything. And even with this one, yeah, I know it has the distressed look anyway. That's not stuff that's peeled off of it. It was the actual design itself. Um, but it, it's absolutely fantastic. Prices range from around about £22 to £23 for a t-shirt. They also do sweatshirts as well, which is obviously going to be slightly more. Um, my only problem is I have issues with t-shirts in the fact of sizing. Sometimes I'll order a small and it'll be perfect. Right length, right tightness, kind of fitted t-shirt, great. Sometimes I'll go out and I'll buy a small, and a small is almost like I've been shrink wrapped in it. Sometimes I'll go out and I'll buy a medium, a medium is fine, it's the right length, it's the right fit across the back, not tight under the arms, perfect. Sometimes I'll avoid a small, go for a medium, and a medium ends up on myself looking like a maxi dress, um, which the mediums on this I could have definitely done with a small because Arm length is right, but the length on me is, I like my sort of like t-shirts up to about sort of here, just underneath your belt line. Sorry for that horrible view there, but yeah, I kind of like my t-shirts up to around about here, a bit more fitted. So I could have possibly done with a small, um, and it's the same, because obviously the t-shirts are the same size. Um, this one is as well, um, but, I could have probably done with a small because I do like a slightly more fitted t-shirt up to around about sort of there-ish mark. But the thing with We Are Scumbag, Scumbag Clothing UK, is the designs. There are so, so many designs. He's constantly tinkering, putting up new designs and everything. And it's really, it's, it's so nice when you go on a website, Instagram page or something like that, and you go, that's cool, I like that one. Oh, that's really smart, I like that one. There's just some really, really good designs because I love my tattoos, there's lots of tattoo designs, alternative designs, kind of all with a scumbag UK twist to them, uh, Peaky Blinder designs there are, there's all sorts of different stuff out there. And the quality on the t-shirts, absolutely phenomenal. I cannot complain at all. Um, he'll sit there and he sort of tinkers about and I cannot rate him enough, to be honest. The customer service with him is great. He sort of bends over backwards. Not that I've ever seen him bending over backwards, nor would I like to. 
but to kind of help and do what you can to help to make sure you get the product that you're kind of looking for, which is really, really nice to see, that you don't get, like I say, with these huge, massive brands. You go into a shop and what there is, there is, and if you don't like it, well, don't buy it. And the thing that I like about these smaller brands, um, we are scumbags, devilishly bearded, other brands and stuff like that, um, Lone Wolf, that they cater. If you've got an issue, if you've got a problem, uh, Percy Cute Tees is another one, that if you've got a problem, you've got an issue, you want something a certain way, can you do this? They will try and help you. You don't get that with huge brands, which is why I'm here trying to support the smaller brands out there. But I just absolutely love it. I've had no issues with it whatsoever. Design is great. Design stayed in there. Um, originally it was a square design. He's kind of like changed it and chopped it and altered it. It's absolutely stunning. I absolutely love it. Could have done with a size smaller, but hey, what do you do? What do you do if sometimes you're a size small and sometimes you're a size medium and you don't know, so you order a medium, it's too big, you order a small and it's too small. You can't win, but that's life. But like I say, links are going to be down below to Scumbag Clothing, some really amazing designs on his website um, and on his Instagram. Please, please, please show him some support, some help. Give him a follow as well. Um, since I put the post, uh, the photo up on Instagram, I've had comments, people saying, oh, that's really smart, where'd you get that from? Oh, I really like the t-shirt and everything else. So please show them some support because without these smaller brands, they're just going to disappear. And without them, all we're going to have are these massive, faceless, faceless brands. So yeah, loads of different designs, depending on what you're after. I will certainly be ordering a couple more from him. And I hope you've enjoyed this little review this afternoon. I've tried to keep it a bit short because I don't know whether my videos are too long, too short, whichever. I just, I really care and I'm passionate about what I'm doing here. And to be honest, if I can get one person following, one person buying from one of these small brands, one person to take interest, one person to care, that's what I'm here for, you know. And I don't, like I say, I don't charge for what I do or anything. It's purely because I think craftsmanship and artwork and small brands is a dying art. When you've got these huge, massive factory-made or factory-made sorts of brands that are just pumping stuff out, they have no care or passion behind what they're doing. It's all about money. And don't get me wrong, yeah, we need to make money in order to keep a roof over our head, food's on the table, and the miss is happy, which hopefully is most of the time. Um, but... It, it's kind of, they have passion in what they're doing and it's what is the creativity and the passion that we need to help and support so i hope you have enjoyed this review this afternoon top top marks from uh scumbag clothing uk we are scumbags on instagram like i say could have done with a small but there you go that's life um have a great one thank you so so much to scumbag clothing for sending this through absolutely stunning work i hope you have a great fantastic weekend I've got two more reviews left, and that's it. And after that, don't know what then. But I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend, wherever you are in the world, whatever you're getting up to, whatever you're doing, whatever you're planning on doing, take care of each other. Please keep on helping, supporting each other, and above all, I know this world is a mad place that we're living on at the moment, but keep on loving each other. You only live once. Make the most of it. Stay safe. Take care. Hope, good. Hope to see you guys soon. Thank you.